Bringing him in was adding another first name superstar. He's high stepping! He throws into the end zone! A spectacular run by Curtis Martin! I just felt like they had as much confidence in me as I had in myself. The Saints have won the Super Bowl! Touchdown by the power of Priest Holmes. Third touchdown in the last five minutes for Priest Holmes. What a run. I said I'd love to see this guy turn him loose and see what he can do. And that will be the rushing record for Priest Holmes. Of all the great ball carriers who have worn the red, white, and gold, none have had more rushing yards in a single season than the Priest. Holmes gets it up the middle, breaks three into the secondary, 40, 35, angles left, 10, 5, touchdown, Kansas City. He is really showing his ability there because you can't teach that. Here it is again behind Richardson, outside, puts it in, touchdown, he walks right in, there's the NFL record. No player in the history of the National Football League has done that in a single season as Preach goes to the promised land. Five Cannon, Gannon! Kirby behind Crockett, play action, Gannon looping for the end zone, it is caught! Touchdown! Rich Gannon having a monster day. Rich Gannon has thrown five, count them, five touchdown passes today. Niners blitz, it's picked up, Gannon throws oh, on right, open got it, he's got it, he's got it, touchdown! Timmy Brown, the Oakland Raiders have won the game. Rich Gannon, for a tenth time this year, he has passed for over 300 yards in a game. Gannon looks left, nobody open, he can run for the end zone. Here he goes, Gannon into the end zone. Touchdown, Raiders! The two-decade drought is over, America. The silver and black are back. From his distinctive look to his 160 career sacks, linebacker Kevin Green was a true original and a difference maker at every stage of his career. Felt that he'd fit perfectly into our defense when he was a free agent in 93. There's Kevin Green with a sack. A relentless player. He, he played the game with passion. He had a lot of fire to him. Nice, nice, nice. You could see that uh, he was a very emotional player. You know that he was going to play with his heart and soul and, and uh, the fire and the attitude that you wanted. Green kept the pressure on, and he sacked again. That savvy led to more sacks than any other linebacker in NFL history. I'm excited to be here. Um, I'm looking forward to playing some more football, and what better place than to do it right here. Oh, what a throw by Graybeard, Kurt Warner. Warner with ton of time, throwing right side, fits open, caught at the five, heading for the pylon, in oh. touchdown Cardinals! Understand what we got at stake now. Oh. It's like nothing you've ever felt before. Let's get back to business, let's shock the world. Warner takes, gonna throw a fade, right side, Fitzgerald, he got it! Touchdown, Larry Fitzgerald! Warner to pass with time, fires over the middle to Fitz, caught at the 45, 50, Fitz is loose, 40, 30, goodbye! Then the Cardinals lead Super Bowl 43. And Simeon Rice is on a tear. Here's the snap, out of the two-minute warning. Ramsey, he'll go down again! That was all Simeon right there coming back door. When Simeon Rice takes the inside, he reminds me a lot of Charles Haley. Three-step drop, Gannon looking under pressure. Simeon Rice sacks him at the 23. Here's the snap, Gannon, three-step drop, looks so they'll pump fake, pump fake. He'll go down, Rice has two. It's time to make history today. He steps up, throws it down the middle. It's picked off with the football. Patsy Ferrier. Let's turn it up. We still ain't got no turnover. He's back, has plenty of time. Now he's flushed out of the pocket. And he's hit. Intercepted with the football up the field. Running with it is James Ferrier. They signed me to a six year long term deal that was three times what Mr. Kraft had offered me. The pitch to Martin, Curtis across the 45, slips out of a tackle down to the 40. He's gone down the sideline, 20. Curtis at the 15, left back 10 to the goal line, touchdown. 60 yards and a great run. The thing that he did well was that he was elusive. They just never really got a great shot at him. 
The pitch running wide. A spectacular run by Curtis Martin. Having perhaps his greatest day as an NFL player. Curtis Martin can play through pain about as well as any player that I've come across in the league. He's been hurt a lot, still finds a way to get a thousand yards. I ended up getting focused on getting 1,700 yards in a year. I made all my pass codes to the building 1,700. All my codes to my phones were 1,700. Curtis Martin, just shy of 200 yards on the ground. You know, there was a lot of uh, talk about Martin declining. I don't see any decline in Curtis Martin. This guy is something special. The satisfaction wasn't the fact that I was the rushing leader as much as that I was the oldest person to ever lead the league in rushing. They thought I was done. They thought I couldn't play the game anymore. He's lost a step. Can't coach him. Could I still play football? No question about it. Charles Woodson breaking free on the blitz. Scooped up by Woodson. Yeah! Go one! Go one! To the 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown, Charles Woodson. If you disrupt the ball, they will fall. Anytime I went to make a tackle, I was going after the football. Charles Woodson's the man who triggered it loose. Charles Woodson, he is always doing those tomahawk chops going after the football, and he got it loose. Looking right, throws the right side, intercepted. <laughs> Charles Woodson down the left sideline to the 15, 10, 5, touchdown. Charles Woodson is basically taking Calvin Johnson out of this football game. And there is your dagger. You talk about an all-pro, all-universe performance. The Green Bay Packers are world champions of football! I'm so happy to be in Tampa Bay. We have an incredibly exciting season ahead. I can't wait, and let's go Bucks. Back shoulder toward Mike, he makes the catch! Touchdown Tampa Bay! What a catch by Evans, perfect throw by Brady. Caught ball, touchdown Chris Godwin, touchdown Tampa Bay! Everybody that was a free agent, I feel like Tampa was uh, always going to be at the top of their list because you know Tom Brady's not going to really be on a losing team. Play action fake, lob to the end zone, Gronkowski with a touchdown, and that New England combination now in Buccaneer Pewter and Red. Tom and the offense was clicking, you know, he's making throws. 30 of 46, 369 yards, five touchdowns. It's Tom, you give Tom an inch, he's going to take it a mile. And that's what he did. Brady looking Brady. Throws the ball downfield. He's got Evans toward the end zone. Evans makes the catch. What a great throw by Brady. Can any quarterback in the league throw that pass any better than Tom Brady just did? Brady looking, Brady looking, looking, looking. Throws toward the end zone. Touchdown, Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Bucks are the Super Bowl champs. Hallelujah. How about them Bucks? You know, Marvin called me pretty quick when free agency started. We needed help. I said, Rod, are you ready to make the move to safety? It'll make us a better football team. We're just gonna get our best players on the field. Well, it's a new position, and I think it fits Rod Woodson. Playing safety, that's that's a piece of cake. And the first year I was at safety, I was voted to the Pro Bowl. This legend, he's never touched glory. Everybody was on board, it's like, we getting Rod a Super Bowl. We went out there and had a ball. Ike Hilliard got oh. hammered by Rod Woodson. The Ravens are the champions of the world. Right when Friggs started, you get a call from Al Davis. You want to be a Raider? I was like, yep. Your body is a step slower. You don't jump as high, but you see it faster. Rod Woodson jumps right in front of Clinton Portis, and he takes off. You think Rod Woodson can't run anymore? He's going to take it all the way. When Kevin Mawai stepped on the field, his opponent knew he was bringing passion, intensity, determination, and a hunger to win on every play. Kevin Mawai, the center, just a terrific job of driving, driving, turning the guy away. It was in New York where Kevin would begin to write his legacy as one of the greats, earning six Pro Bowl appearances. And in 2004, he didn't miss a single game while helping pave a path for Curtis Martin to lead the NFL in rushing. Three minutes, 60 offense. minutes, three and a half hours, whatever it takes. This is our house. We're going to dominate up front. We're going to dominate our special teams. We're going to dominate in the backfield. I think I earned the respect of players around the league by how I played the game. 
Steve, during his free agency period, kind of changed free agency for guards. And when you have a guard that's, that's talented as Steve was and, and plays as hard as he does, you realize what, what that can do for your franchise. Yeah, if you see that DN start to come in, you just got to bounce. He was a mauler, man. He just wanted to run guys over. A guy that's going to come in and, and, and knock guys off the line of scrimmage. And I think the thing about Steve is that he did it consistently. A lot of people would tell you during his era, Steve was uh, the best guard in the league. Back to pass, hit, sack, fumble. The pressure came from Mike Vrabel, enormous pressure. And that gives Mike Vrabel now 10 sacks on the season. Mike Vrabel is a linebacker, but when people remember his contributions to the Patriots, they're not going to remember the tackles that he made. They're going to remember the touchdowns that he caught. And Mike Vrabel comes into the game. They will both be checking in as eligible receivers. Seymour, the fullback offset right, play action fake, Brady, fires, touchdown to Mike Vrabel! Patriots take the lead! You hear about certain players, then you're like, oh my God, he's coming here? Deion Sanders is now a 49er. I think they had the understanding of this is work, this is a job, we gotta come in and do it. Now I came in and said, hey, we gonna work, but we gonna play. It's intercepted, is he inbounds, Deion? Down the right side, yes! He's to the 50, they can't stop him. He can high step this one half the field. He's high stepping, he's to the 10, he strolls into the end zone. Deion Sanders, interception touchdown. In Jerry's mind, I think he felt that the only way we get back to the Super Bowl is that we take Deion Sanders away from San Francisco and put him on our team. Bringing him in was not just adding the best cornerback in football, but it was adding another first name superstar to an organization that people said, geez, have, don't they have enough? He throws to the sideline. It's intercepted by Deion Sanders. I don't know why you try to beat Deion Sanders. Sanders to the 30. He starts the high <laughs> step at the 25, and he puts the maraschino cherry on a Sunday of an evening. And Dallas, you can celebrate because your Cowboys are world champions again. It's the end of Peyton Watch and the beginning of the Peyton era in Denver. A five-year, $96 million deal. When I got here to Denver, it was a hybrid offense of plays that they wanted to run, but also plays that I had run before. And that was really important because I was kind of having to learn to play football in a different way physically. It would have been hard to also have to learn to play football a new way mentally at the same time. Manning takes a snap, looks left, throws left. Welker's got it, he spins inside the tackle, and Wes Welker has his first touchdown as a Denver Bronco. He's got Welker wide open, touchdown Denver. Manning, by the way, has tied an NFL record with his seventh career game with at least five touchdown passes. Seventh touchdown pass, and this is against the Ravens. Oh. Julius Thomas wide right. Six-man pressure, Peyton throws home run. He's got Julius Thomas there. Thomas with the touchdown, and there's the record. Move over, Tom Brady. That chair belongs to Peyton Manning this year. Third down a goal from the nine. Peyton empty backfield, three-man rush. He bounces around and throws. Touchdown, Demarius Thomas. Move over, Brett Favre, and make room for the new king. Owen Daniels from Peyton Manning, a gain of 18 on the first play of the game. Peyton looks right, throws right, and the two-point conversion is good. The Denver Broncos are world champions. They have just won Super Bowl 50. And another long offseason for Reggie White. And a lot of questions as to whether he'll be back in a green uniform next year. I was really impressed when I came up here the first time. I, green Bay was the farthest thing from my mind. And with the direction the team is going, I think they they have a total commitment to winning. He's the preacher man that flips and turns like a beast. You know, his nickname is the Minister of Defense. Here they come, and here comes Reggie after one. Young down yeah. by Reggie White, and the game is going to be won by the Packers. Reggie White, to me, is one of the all-time great steals in, in free agency. He's back in the pocket again. They cannot get to him. Now they do. There he goes. Reggie, Reggie. White on the sack. Reggie came out of nowhere, Jim. He got rid of that. Did he come quick? Did he come quick? When he closes, nobody closes faster. It has finally arrived. The day we've waited for, I guess, for about 29 years now for the Green Bay Packers to play in the Super Bowl. Here is the quarterback, Bledsoe. Here they come again. There's oh. Reggie got him. There he goes at the 22-yard line. Reggie what? got him again. He jumped over him. He beat him inside. That time he beat him outside. That guy is shell-shocked. 
And here goes Bledsoe back. Here they come. They Reggie. got him again. Back at the 20. Hello, Reggie. Three sacks Three. for Reggie. Oh, my goodness. What a way to end it. We Reggie a... White. Is this heaven or what? It don't get any better than this. Stephon Gilmore, I'm telling you, I think he's the best defensive player in the NFL. His tape speaks for itself. His numbers speak for itself. Picked off. Gilmore down the sideline. See you later. His technique is flawless. He's one of those DBs that you sit back and you're like, how, how do I get open? You know, how, how do I beat him? Because he's just, he's so athletic and incredible football IQ. Gilly Lock jumps it at the 29 yard line, and there's the takeaway by Gilmore covering Cooper. I, I don't haven't seen a corner that's played any better than he has. Big time player, made a big time play in the Super Bowl. Takes the snap, Harmon on a blitz, Goff throws it to the right. Gilmore's there, yeah. intercepted at the four! Gilmore comes up with it, and the Patriots have won their sixth Super Bowl title. Give us to Turner. He'll cut back, 35-40, record book. An alarm just went off all across the NFC as they announced it here in the Dome that Michael Turner's broken the club record for rushing in one game. He's so hard to bring down. I've talked about it all through the preseason, how he runs behind his pads. He has that great forward body lean, and when you try to throw on those big tree trunk legs, you just bounce off. 10-5, Michael Turner touchdown. Four rushing scores for Michael Turner. Takes it, heads up the middle, he will score. Touchdown Atlanta, and that'll be a dagger right there. The heart and soul of the defense is Pro Bowl linebacker Hardy Nickerson. Throws right, throws right. Fires it over the middle, it is intercepted, picked off by the Buccaneers. It is Hardy Nickerson at the 30. Well, the Tampa Bay Buccaneer defense has played so well today. Dropping the pass away, it's picked off. Intercepted by Hardy Nickerson, and that should do it with 17 seconds left. Drew Brees getting a six-year, $60 million deal with $10 million in guaranteed money. I just felt like they had as much confidence in me as I had in myself. And I know that this town is craving a winner, and you're going to get one. It's not the city strong. They hold up the trophy. We're our city. Breeze. Here's the throw to Shockey, and it's a touchdown. The Damn miracle mercy. in Miami has happened. The Saints have won the Super Bowl. Split backs, needing seven yards. Breeze. Wide open, and Smith, what a way to do it! And that ball is going to be headed to Cam Nohire. A 62-yard touchdown pass is the way that Drew Brees fittingly goes into the record book. In front of these fans, and in this city, where when he first came here, they desperately needed a hero, and he needed to be one. That's how much this man means to these people.